imported food. There has been a lot of speculation around it saying that the food that we consume is not the food that people claim or the importers claim that we're eating. For example, the imported chicken that we consume, most people believe that it's not actually chicken. It's uh, wild birds, which includes vultures and all of those birds that people don't deem it fit for consumption. And also when it comes to street food, this has been an issue because most people in the Gambia live off of street food. We eat um, ebe, for example, we eat fish pie, for example, we eat uh, nanburu and all of those things that are purchased or that are sold in the streets. So my question to you guys today is, do you actually believe, what are your opinions on the speculations around imported food that we are not consuming, what we think we are consuming, and also street food. Is it healthy for people to go around and be consuming street food, knowing, not knowing the background of how that food was prepared and even how the food is being sold? Wow, I mean, uh, later, I was going to say that 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 I was Dear na kendo ko ubi diko raha so lun fa def warning ko ba hel bu ba ha ba ama no mung nyu don to na nyu ne nyu picha picha yeng tempo zi ne kasi kana me yeng le kan to yu nyu e def ni wo ko wara so lo lun jar na ba hel bu ba ha ba so hara re nyu yata lo wasa an be legi nyu ba hel bu ba ha ba so hara re nyu yata lo wasa an be legi nyu ba hel bu ba ha ba so hara re nyu yata lo wasa an be legi nyu ba hel bu ba ha ba so hara re nyu yata lo wasa an be legi nyu ba hel bu ba ha ba so Leka dinko gaza gas bem lah lagi dinko muzi sani. Naba leka bi muduru, mu nyor sindaya mengajil ko ngajai ko sah moga na healthy ko mengko ay gas. Buka ya kan tu kopar bi luli warning ko ay health buka apa? Um, am najeri, am rio midal, soal of lah ay wasabi, yo. Nah, boleh jadi Gambia, jadi Gambia am independent. Since Gambia got independent to date, um, the 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 narrative continues to be the narrative. Or we import rice, rice in the Gambia, which is our main staple food in the Gambia. Even flour, we import it in the Gambia. Chicken, the same thing. Sugar, the same thing. Anything that we consume, even the clothes, clothes yeah. that we wear, mm -hmm. is uh, we import. And, and remember, um, coronavirus was good, uh, was was bad for us, but it caused more disaster in the Gambia. Mm -hmm. Yeah. If if, yeah. if the sea transportation was close, mm -hmm. then it means that the Gambia will die. So this is just to say that our government, there are time Adamo Baro, Jami and the others, and even us, we not prioritizing agriculture. Yeah. Um, it is only in the Gambia where uh, farmers are regarded as a poor. Um, it is also in the Gambia where farmers are regarded as a layman work. Well, I'm a farmer. Exactly. He has been advocating um, for farming a lot. Yeah, you know, Amla, because uh, what yeah. happened is um, there are people looking at us, mm -hmm. and people are tired. Mm -hmm. Governments in the diaspora are sending huge amount of money every month uh, just to feed their family. Mm -hmm. And their family, even even Bisab, secure the money. Exactly. Bisab, which is very secure. simple. So we are lazy and we will suffer the detriment. Most definitely. The government is doing what is, uh, what is expected of them, but equally, the people are also not doing what is expected of them. In the government here, Charles are getting us. Exactly. Yo hola reglu gana dia mahu kasus sabur ambu siri ada problem nak kasus. And we have a lot of it. Hola. Okay, nunjuk kan dunia defini. Bob Nasiyo. Mama musang dalam workshop. Ambu kuno di direct of health. Yo ambil parini ambil ni hana ni ni hamga. Kuno yang hai tiap hari kau ni hai kena hiu boleh makan kena riway. Mula jis nunjuk kan dia posan lah. Jim bawa bunsi dia. Yeah. Yo mahu affect sih. Nya ku punyum. It's not meant for exactly. human consumption. Exactly. Human consumption. You don't have to eat your body. Why do you have different coffee? Is that how many people you have already? Most of them bop in your yahoo. You know, you're going to have a lot of people. You're going to have a lot of people. Yeah. You're going to show you a lot of people. You're going to have 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 a lot of people. Yeah. Because when you get, when you get like a thing or a set, when you know you see your thing, you set. That set, come look at eyes over here. You do go see where I'm going to get now. So when you get now, you're not going to have problem. Yeah. The new rule will be a problem. The time will be food and safety. 
Magna and Jaja, I know they're doing a great work, mm -hmm. but um, there's still room for improvement. Immigration also, they um, have a great work when it comes to like I know why one go all at that. The whole be is collective effort as we are. Mm -hmm. uh, discipline is very important when it comes to this aspect. Uh, we have so we saw um, certain countries in Africa, even donkey they can kill and you know just sell for the people. And people, yeah. Unfortunately, the authorities were wise enough to, 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 to put them on um, before the, before the mm -hmm. law. But in the Gambia, um, it's rather unfortunate, or I did not see where health personnel are going around to see what is in the market. But they need to try. But we equally as Gambians, as civilians, should definitely be the, you know, the pioneers of trying to make sure that we eat food that are safety. And you know, eating food that is, that is safety is comfortable. It's make life comfortable for you. Gambia, they am different from sugar. They am different from asthma. Yeah. What we consume, we should really look uh, into it. Like whatever you put in your uh, stomach, because the stomach is a very sensitive organ. Mm -hmm. Whatever, like like she said in Wolof, you can't open up the stomach and wash it clean because you put something bad in it. Mm -hmm. So to avoid all the complications that you might get from consuming stuff or food that is bad, do not consume uh, food that is bad for you. Because looking at the, the way that these food, because you don't even know how they are prepared. Looking at the way they are being prepared, looking at the way they are being sold, you can definitely tell that um, this food is not good for me. But sometimes these people that are selling it, they mask the way that they um, sell this food. Like I always say, I always tell this story to people. One day I was like going through Seraconda Market. I am also one person that was very fond of uh, street food. So I, it was uh, corn time and corn season, and this woman was roasting corn over fire. Now when, when she roasts the corn, she places on a wooden plank. That plank caught fire, and what she did was, I was terrified when I saw this. She went to the gutters, put the, uh, the plank into the water to you know, bring down the fire so that he, she can extinguish the fire, and she went back and put this, this um, roasted corn that are supposed to be consumed by people she put them back on the plank. So you can see that uh, you don't they even know. Jina jina jina. <laughs> so you don't know what you're putting inside you because Bobo. probably I saw it, that's why I did not buy it. Bobo but Bobo. the person that did not see before would just come and consume it. Exactly, you see a lot of things that are, and it's, it's very heartbreaking for but so many people like that are depending, yeah, exactly, <laughs> that are depending on uh, street food because most people don't they have jobs that will not allow them to cook so it's very sad that uh, the food that they are consuming is not healthy for them yeah the guy security am not solo torop ndax nit yi lega to security yeah da ngay jox sa kier sa lewon di wo dem job nga dem ci jaay kat bi ni jaay bi ci jaay ma jaay ma bi ni jaay wa tuf ri ay waccat yeah exactly wa ni ma gis time bo mu ni di def moy da ngay security ñoo tok fond de comme salam wulé ni ko yeah in the morning yeah yeah fond de ngeen lega tuti ali feel comfortable la ngay ñewat kier ay bi parena Mm -hmm. But we are adopting that. We are adopting it. 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 We, we cannot totally condemn street Shift. selling yeah. because uh, yeah. we know how it, it's contributing to the economy of this country and yeah. GDP. Mm -hmm. uh, I have known and interacted with a lot of women who are street vendors who are paying for the tuition fee Fees for their of, kids yeah. at the university. Mm -hmm. you know, and, and they're paying every day sales tax at the, at the, at the market to, to local And companies. daily food on the table and as well. Yeah. yeah, so they are the breadwinners. But, uh, the reason for the establishment of the and food safety is, is, is here to check these people yeah. and the things that they put out to, to, to the people. Mm -hmm. uh, some time ago, uh, public health workers were very, very still uh, vibrant though, but uh, I remember when I was growing up, uh, there's this butcher in Australia. Mm -hmm. uh, they, they butchered a, 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 a cow and selling yeah. it. 
So the public health officer came in and found out that the, the, the cow is kind of, the, 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 uh, the, the, the flesh is, the meat is kind of contaminated. Come, yeah. Yeah, he just, he just mm. poured poison on the whole thing and they went and, you know, they, they, they discarded it. Yeah. yeah. So those are the things that will start coming. And also, uh, if even this juice and stuff at the, at the market, so going up, if your mom go to Nduga, yeah. No, you can't go to the Exactly. Yeah. Mom, did you bring something for me? Basically, yeah. what Buba is saying that uh, most of the time, especially it's a Gambian <laughs> culture, or it's also an African culture. When your mom goes out to, you know, do her daily shopping, to, when she's coming back, you always expect her to bring something. Normally, it is ice. So when she comes back, you ask her, Mama, did you bring something for me? And, and, and also, she brings something all, for you. Also, yeah. uh, our, our primary to high schools. Uh, I've attended this in Augusta High School. It's a boys' school, but uh, we rely on vendors. Yeah. At the school, you know, uh, you will see some people who will not even bring lunch to school, or they will bring it, but but they will keep it to themselves. Yeah. So when we go to these vendors, we will make a queue, and we will be starting pushing each other, a lot of noise, a lot of bed throwing all over, and some people will just be standing behind you. If you buy before you turn, they just mama, the girl. Exactly. So what some of us will do is we will buy our bread and open it in front of everybody. No. Yeah. Like so yeah. yeah, and put so our in it. Spit on it. Yeah, like spit on it. So yeah. they wouldn't ask us to ask, give yeah. something to them. <laughs> so do, those are all the struggles that yeah. we go through. Thank you very much <laughs> for that. <laughs> it's, it's very <laughs> interesting. <laughs> it's very unhygienic. No, no, it's not like that. No, 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 no. When you think you have a new, 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 the food and safety. Yeah, it's interesting. After them, you know, the them say, man, say, the whole thing, I have a tent, and you want there, the whole thing, you want there. Now, expire, wood, well, expire. <laughs> yeah, thank you very much. Uh, that was a very interesting uh, topic that we brought to converse on. And it's very interesting that these are uh, uh, topics that we should really keep on talking about and sen sensitize the people and educate the people on it. That brings us uh, to, the end, um, to the end of this issue. Um, thank you very much for watching.